All week long, we've been asking you to send us your favorite pizza places around the state for part of National Pizza Week. And boy, did you all deliver. And today we are heading to some of the most voted spots here in our state for a special edition of Foodie Friday. This morning, we've got Fox 61 Sean Pergano making his Foodie Friday comeback. He's in New Haven right now. Yeah, he was at Sally's before. Now he's at Modern Beats, right? We've gone from pizza to a beats in the past couple of hours, Sean. <laughs> Yeah, modern uh, beats. That's right. Not uh, too far. Although I did walk the whole way, so I burned off some of those some of those calories. But yeah, at uh, one of the famous places here uh, in New Haven, modern uh, beats. And just just take come on over here, Bill. Take a look at this. Look, get this action right here. How about that? Fresh out of the oven. And I got to introduce my man Colin uh, uh, back with us. And Colin, I, I'm gonna get on this side of you. Talk to me a little bit. I know you're with the Taste of New Haven. You have come a book. You have, right, right. Come on. <laughs> you, have, you have a book out. You have uh, all sorts of things happening. But when you see this come out, and you could just smell the goodness, it's like crank up, smell a vision, baby. Talk to me about this. Oh man, there's nothing like a good uh, beats in the morning. Let me tell you. And so, they're open right now. They're open, so you can dine in here at Modern. You can pick up. Um, they do some some delivery as well, but. Uh, this is special. Modern Beats has been around since 1934, family owned. Uh, you got multiple generations working here. You got people who've been working here for 30 years plus. Um, this is amazing Beats. This is a true old school style of beets, thin crust, charred when you, you know, when, where you need it. You got your toppings. This is the Italian bomb. Um, this is a, a, a pie that's considered health food. I'm going to tell you why. It's got more <laughs> vegetables than meat, but there's a lot of meat. So, so there's that. But you got three kinds of meat, four kinds of veggies. You got mozzarella, and you got your sauce. Yeah, and talk to me about the oven that it comes out. It comes out of a oil-fired, old-school oven. It was originally coal, converted to oil. It's a huge oven, a lot like you know a Pepe's or a Sally's. But this is the this is where good pizza is made. This is how it happens. Oh yeah. Yeah, and 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 we have a we have a, a seafood pie, right? Yeah, this is a white clam. This is your traditional New Haven style pizza invented by Frank Pepe, uh, and and created and perfected by so many others now. This is what they do here for their white clam. God, you uh, could just smell it. I mean, through the mask and everything. I'm just so excited. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't tell him to say that, by the way. <laughs> come on. <laughs> ah. <laughs> See, I got you. So, so yeah, so so this pie. All right, so the white clam, this is a New Haven thing. Um, and any New Haven proper place will make a good white clam pie. They know how to do it. So if you go to any place around Connecticut or around the country, they got to have a white clam if they're going to be a New Haven pizzeria. Yeah, and, and, and a little bit about you. I know, aren't you doing some virtual classes now on how to make pizza? To yeah, to... so if you love your pizza but you want to stay home, uh, we're doing a virtual pizza classes uh, all through the winter. Our first one is next Tuesday, pizzainamerica.com. It's going to be awesome. We got uh, Jimmy from Zupardi's Abits there to help cook. We're going to make some amazing pizza. You can do it from home. Can I have my own come on pie? Yeah, we're going to do a come on pie. It's going to be, it's going to be commando. Com com commando? Commando. No, nobody will even nobody will even see it coming. Don't even <laughs> don't don't make me go there. <laughs> All right. So this here is the uh, you said the meat lovers, right? This is for the meat lovers. I, I think it's got your name on it. All right. Let's try this. Bear with me here, folks. Going one-handed. <laughs> oh boy. Is this going to be hot too? Oh uh, yeah. On the level of hot, I'd say it's going to be scorching. Oh. It's a fork and knife pie. <laughs> Look at that. Huh? This is, that's, un, you're right. I, I taste the vegetables. <laughs> you guys like pizza? Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, right on. <laughs> we have fans here. But yeah, that, that's phenomenal. You know what I like about it? There's not an overflow of, um, of sauce. No. You, you, you know what I mean? You have a little bit, you have a little bit of sauce taste, but you, you, you get a little bit of the crunch. I mean, I, I'm crunching. I know, I know some of the meat, but I'm telling you, I'm crunching some of the vegetables as well. Yeah, you know, pizza's, pizza's a, a bread, but with the bread, there's sauce traditionally, right? Once you put a bunch of toppings on, you got to balance it out. Crust has to hold everything up. The sauce can't be overpowering. Then you got your cheese layer. You got your, your topping layer. This is all what pizza's about. It's about kind of your fancy. Um, I like it simple. I'm a simple guy, but people love this stuff. This yeah. is... This is what Adam Richmond started Man vs. Food on, was a large one of these, a large Italian bomb. So, I mean, this is where, this is where legends are made.
Yeah. And you know what? Pizza wasn't invented in New Haven, but it was perfected right here, baby. Right. Pizza you know what? Story made a it, documentary about it, it. It, is fo- it is Foodie Friday, y'all. <laughs> and are you guys going in to eat? Yep. Oh, come on. This door right here. Let me get the door for you. <laughs> Live on television as we toss it back to uh, Tim, and Tim and Ashley. How about that? Come on, enjoy. Please. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, baby. Sean, yeah. you have done such a fabulous job today. It's been so fun to watch you back doing Foodie Friday. Yeah. It's just his facial expressions. You can tell he is a foodie. Yes. He loves pizza the way I love pizza, so I could see myself in him just getting so excited, you know? And crushing and so a pizza. Genuine. And cr- yeah, crushing it. And I feel like he would be a legend if one of those places, Modern or Sally's, came up with like a come on pizza just for Sean. Just we got to do it now. Somebody's got to do it. It can happen. We have to write a petition. What do we got to do? Yeah. Yeah. If you are water? watching and you own a pizza shop in Connecticut, let us know. Do if you it, can make please. a Come on pizza. That would be great. <laughs>